folks, Nick Harrington here, and I wanted to give a little bit of a breakdown kind of between the Rapala Tail Dancer and the Berkeley Flicker Minnow. So in the past, we've kind of talked about my spectrum of baits that I like to use, and tail dancers are generally at the top for when I want to fish really aggressively. They have a really tight, uh, they have a really wide wobble. They draw a lot of attention in the water. Um, but the Flicker Minnow is very similar to that too. And, and basically, this is kind of the same feel as like a Shad Rap versus a Flicker Shad. Your, your tail dancer, again, going to be a balsa bait, not going to rattle. Not going to rattle, and this one, flicker minnow, this one, plastic bait, is going to rattle. Um, both wide actions, both wide wobbles, so going through the water, they kind of act like this. Um, big, aggressive baits, good search baits. Um, again, I like these more, just a little bit clear water scenario, or even those hot days when I can get a big sweeping action. This is when I really like to focus on these tail dancers. Again, these flicker minnows I think do a little bit better in the in the murkier water. I actually, if I have to size down, I'll do like a number five or a number seven flicker minnow. Um, that's generally a good option. I will pull bigger ones though, nines and elevens, and often I'll pull them side by side with a tail dancer, especially if I'm fishing like suspended fish on boards or something like that. Um, but overall, two good baits similar actions, um, similar profiles. Of course, you can make them similar sizes, but just the, the composition of the bait and just kind of the minor changes that that does to the action might be what, what fish prefer one day over another. So don't be afraid to put them both out, vary with them and, and see what those fish prefer. But like I say, again, great baits for attracting really big fish. Big fish love big meals. And number 11 minnows and, and uh, tail dancers are, are tough to beat. And again, it's if you're in dirtier water or you really just need to draw attention to your bait, this, especially these flicker minnows, can be really good for that. Good fishing.